Well, I'm Mayor Chris Hoy, and I'm here today at the City of Salem's IT department with Kevin Pearson, and we're going to learn a little bit about, about what Kevin does and uh, some of the things that go on here over at IT. So thanks for doing this, Kevin. Oh, thank you for having me. I'm a uh, GIS programmer analyst with the data team here at the Enterprise Services Department, City of Salem. Uh, GIS is uh, very simply, it's a, an acronym for Geographic Information Systems. Uh, it's a location-based uh, data and analysis. It's way more than just dots on a map. Uh, specifically, I help to manage and administer the databases, kind of where we store the data and how we, how we create the data. And then I help to uh, facilitate end user platforms where we start to interact with the data and how we present that to management. And how did you get in this line of work? Well, I studied this in college. Um, I've, uh, over, over the course of my career, I've worked in both the private and public sectors and have uh, were, held positions at most levels of government. I uh, began my career with the city of Salem uh, eight years ago where I started in the 911 center and I was managing address and street center line and emergency responder data uh, that we used in the dispatch systems. Um, then I transferred over to the public works department where I began to really manage uh, asset-related information as, as we're integrating with an asset management system. Uh, and then I transferred over here to the Enterprise Services Department four years ago where I began my administrative role uh, in helping to bring the GIS systems for our 20 or so uh, GIS professionals across the city. Very interesting. Thank you for sharing that. Can you talk to us or maybe show us a little bit about what that looks like? GIS brings a series of analysis tools uh, that we can really start to show trends and bring that data forward and how we, uh, how we use that data to make decisions and solve problems. And those problems can be solved to, uh, in this instance, um, how we uh, look at prioritization of uh, replacement of city infrastructure. And it could also be where we send emergency responders and services in, emer in times of emergency. Um, it could be even how we model uh, future enhancements to the transportation network. And we bring these services to both internal and external customers. Uh, we've actually created a new site uh, and, and streamlined our data sharing uh, with the public, and, and that's a data sharing portal we call Data Salem. Interesting. So the public can go in and look at some of the some of the resources that you're referring to here. Correct. Yeah. So this is one of our in internal applications, GeoPortal, where we have a series of maps and content available to to people who want to use it. So this is this is like I said, way more than just dots on a map. Mm -hmm. uh, we're helping to bring. Um, real-time data to our field workers and we we use location intelligence and get that to them right on their mobile devices in the field so the uh, location intelligence really uh, like i said can be the backbone of a lot of things within the city and then we bring those services both to internal and external customers 